Welcome back to the creation. Today we will be going over the top 10 abandoned amusement parks. Make sure you like and subscribe and leave a comment for new suggestions. The decrepit remains of a park that once rung with children's screams, screams of happiness, that is. Similar to abandoned cities, abandoned castles, and other abandoned places, these parks seriously give you the creeps. There's something eerie about a place that once provided so much joy, now not seeing a living soul. If you're brave enough, take a visual stroll through these abandoned amusement parks around the world, some of which you can also take an actual stroll through. Let's get into it. Number 1. Atlantis Marine Park Atlantis Marine Park was opened in 1981. The Atlantis Marine Park attracted tourists from all over the world to a small town called Two Rocks in Perth, Australia. The park enticed visitors with a variety of water-based features, including live dolphin shows and pedal boat rides. However, financial difficulties following the 1987 stock market crash forced the park to close after nine years. Once home to cetaceans and transfixed tourists, the abandoned park now serves as a home for vandals and plant life. Number 2. Prepeat Amusement Park The Prepeat Amusement Park in Ukraine was on course to kick the summer of 1986 with a bang. The park featured a 26-meter Hugh Ferris wheel, bumper carts, swing boats, and more. However, although there was indeed a bang, it wasn't the kind the Soviet Union was planning for. The Chernobyl disaster struck just a few kilometers away and forced the park to close before the grand opening. The park exists today as a dark symbol of the nuclear disaster. Those who sneak into the park should be warned of the radioactive particles around the area. Number 3. Data Park Data Park in Antwerp, Belgium, Data Park aimed to provide experiences for families that were affordable and unforgettable. Unfortunately for one young boy, his forgettable experiences involved him losing an arm while riding on the Nautic Jet ride. Following fierce backlash from visitors which included complaints about other safety concerns, the park closed down in 2002. Today, not much is left at the abandoned park other than ruined equipment and a chilling atmosphere. Number 4. Gulliver's Kingdom Amusement Park Gulliver's Amusement Park, located in the shadow of Mount Fiji in Japan, this unique theme park was designed drawing inspiration from the 18th century story Gulliver's Travels. The park is famous for featuring a 147-foot-long statue of Lemuel Gulliver, the main character from the novel, tied down to the ground. The park shut down in 2001 after just four years due to poor ticket sales. It's expected one of the reasons for the closing due to the park's close proximity to the Aokigara Forest, Japan's infamous suicide forest. Despite being demolished in 2007, the grounds still feature odd structures that give trespassers the feeling that they're not alone in the park. Number 5. Wonderland Amusement Park Wonderland Amusement Park, located in Beijing, China, is one of the eeriest abandoned amusement parks in the world. Its goal was to be the largest amusement park in Asia, stretching across more than 100 acres. That goal would never be met, though construction on the gigantic amusement park stopped in 1998, thanks to property price disagreements. The park, in the middle of construction, was simply abandoned and eventually demolished in 2013. Eerie photos of the massive, abandoned castles and unfinished structures can still be found on the internet though. Number 6. Spree Park Spree Park, located in Berlin, Germany, is a forbidden amusement park in Germany, and for good reasons. The Communist Era Park opened in 1969 East Germany, but it was closed in 2001 and left to the elements. It not features toppled dinosaur statues, rusting roller coasters, and a track leading into a surreal monster mouth. In the coming years, it's expected to reopen as an art center, restoration work has already started on its ferris wheel number seven lake shani amusement park lake shani amusement park is located in rock west virginia beware of this cursed amusement park like something out of a horror movie lake shani was reportedly built on an indian burial ground 
In the 18th century, a bloody confrontation erupted between Native Americans and a colonial family who attempted to settle here. More than a century later, in the 1920s, the amusement park opened on the site, then closed in 1966 after the accidental deaths of two young patrons, including one on the spooky circular swing that still stands. Some say the place is haunted and even claim to have seen ghosts of the park's victims. Number 8. Bablo Island Bablo Island is located in Ontario, Canada. Picture in 1898, Victorian amusement park, music from an organ grinder, women's skirts swishing around the dance hall, children's laughter echoing from the various newfangled rides. That's what this theme park on Bois Blanc Island, nicknamed Bablo, near Detroit, on the Canadian side of Detroit River, was to Michiganders and Canadians alike. Its indoor range was shut nearly a hundred years later, in 1993, and the area is now closed to the public. But you can boat or kayak by the remains, listening for the ghostly sounds of long past visitors. Number 9. Consano. Consano is located in Consano, Italy. This city of toys was conceived in the 1960s as an adult amusement park, a Las Vegas-style resort in the middle of Italy just an hour from Milan. Structures were to be built in different styles, including a Muslim minaret, Chinese pagodas, and a faux medieval castle. There were also plans for a zoo and a racetrack. But tragedy struck in 1976 when a landslide destroyed the road to the city. The plans for the sprawling complex were abandoned, and the half-finished buildings left to decay. Number 10. Fantasy World Fantasy World is located in Limerie, Batangas, Philippines. Another woulda coulda shoulda amusement park, Fantasy World's owners had, well, fantasies of its becoming a Philippines Disneyland. But the place never opened, reportedly due to financial difficulties. Now overgrown with weeds, the rides rusting and paint peeling off the castle, Fantasy World is finding new life as a photo park. For a fee, you can enter the property, look around and take pictures of the eerie theme park. Thank you for watching these 10 abandoned amusement parks. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel and click the notifications bell for any new videos. Tell us some interesting facts that you know and your thoughts on today's video. See you in the next one.